lobster ravioli with tomato and basil. Simply said, and I can promise you, simply delicious. But there are a few Japanese basics that Tetsuya needs to make his magic, like seaweed. One of the most common is wakame. This lot's fresh and comes from Tasmania. The ogo, which is also seaweed, arrives in salt packs from Japan and has to be washed first under running water. Nori is very common, even in Australia. You'll see it in sushi. The darker it is, the better the quality, says Tetsuya. And this, for colour and crunch, is flying fish roe, also now widely available. Finally, a fabulous sauce for the ravioli, made with a tomato base, basil and a rice vinegar flavoured with dried kelp and some extra virgin olive oil. Now forget all the raviolis you've ever had. These are the ingredients Tetsuya uses to make his filling. Lobster, of course. Scallops and scampi don't go amiss. Some tarragon, some chives and some dried kelp. All pulverised with seaweed and just a little cream to make a mousse. In this restaurant, naturally, the ravioli cushions are handmade. Small wonton sheets, which you can buy anywhere these days, are painted with egg white. The nori is placed on the wonton and the mousse filling spooned on top. Now the top sheet is fitted and the edges pressed down. Tetsuya insists there should be no air left inside the parcel. Then the finished ravioli shape is cut out. The final cooking step has the ravioli gently poaching for about six or seven minutes in near boiling water, not boiling or the mousse will lose its soft texture. Now the fun part, assembling the finished dish. Tetsuya starts with a base of wakame seaweed to support the ravioli, which is generously covered with the tomato and basil sauce, decorated with a small nest of ogo, and topped off with a spoon of that brilliant, crunchy flying fish roe. Is there a special wine you'd recommend to go with this lobster ravioli? Uh, I really love, actually, Western Australian Semyon. Well, let's try it. Absolutely superb. Tets, you're a master. From Consuming Passions, Bon Appetit.